Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am sharing my October favorites. I am going to walk through all of the products that I have been loving this month and I'm sure it will come as no surprise. Many of them involve pumpkin. I am clearly obsessed with pumpkin. If you follow my blog, you have been noticing that I've been making pumpkin spice, pumpkin pie, pumpkin everything. So I do have a lot of pumpkin flavored things here, but I also have some other healthy snacks and goodies that I think you guys are really gonna like. All right, so I'm gonna start by showing my favorite canned pumpkin, and this is Organic Canned Pumpkin. The brand is Farmer's Market. I buy a case of this on Amazon every fall. Super cheap, um, it's great quality, it's organic, it tastes good, it's pure. The only ingredient is pumpkin, and it's perfect for all of your pumpkin needs and pumpkin baking. So next up is my favorite pumpkin pie spice. This is an organic spice blend that contains cinnamon, nutmeg, ginger, and cloves. And while I do always have all of those spices on hand, I love using pre-made pumpkin pie spice because it has a great flavor, it's super easy, you can just measure it as is. And I have been using this in everything. If you saw my pumpkin spice almond butter recipe, that uses this. I have a pumpkin spice blondie recipe that is coming to the blog in a couple weeks that also uses this. So anytime you need pumpkin pie spiced anything, you guys can use this instead of mixing all of those ingredients together and it tastes awesome. The next two things I have are both pumpkin flavored and they're actually things that you can buy at the grocery store. So the first is this cereal from Barbara's. These are their puffins cereal and this is the limited edition pumpkin flavor. This is incredible, you guys. It tastes so good. I am so in love with it. I've been buying box after box. It's the perfect little snack. This one is gluten-free and vegan. The ingredients are super pure. You don't really have to worry about any of those funky ingredients with a brand like this. Um, I think it's one of the best store-bought cereals you can find. Of course, it is higher carb, higher sugar, um, so it's maybe not something that you would want to make your base of your meal, but it's a great snack, it's a great sweet treat, and I have been digging it. You guys know how much of a fan I am of tortilla chips. I love tortilla chips. They are my vice. If there was one thing that I I could never live without, it would probably be tortilla chips. Whenever I open a bag, I pretty much polish them off. I just am obsessed with them. So when I saw these at the grocery store, I had to get them and they are so good. So these are pumpkin chips, pumpkin tortilla chips, and they are from the brand Garden of Eden. I really love this brand's chips. My favorite are the Red Hot Blues, but these are one of their seasonal additions and they taste really good. And what I really like about this brand is that they're gluten-free, they're vegan, they are non-GMO, and they use really good ingredients. Of course, I have to eat one right now because I've been like thinking about tortilla chips, so. Mm. So I will say, they're a little bit on the sweet side, so they definitely have like a pumpkin pie like flavor to them. And I think they definitely have like some cinnamon and a little bit of sugar on them, but they are really good with chili and they're really good with salsa and they're actually also really good with guac. So if you can find the pumpkin flavor, definitely get it because it's a fun treat and you might as well, why not, right? So the next thing I have for you is a frozen veggie burger that I just discovered. I've seen other bloggers and YouTubers talk about this brand before and I'd never tried them. So when I saw them at Whole Foods, I decided to pick up a package and I really, really like them. So the brand is Hillary's, and the flavor that I have right here are the Hemp and Greens Burger, and these are a vegan, gluten-free, delicious veggie burger option that you can find in most grocery stores. So I will just tell you, the ingredient list is really simple. They are a base of whole grain millet, and then they also mix in some leafy greens like kale, arugula, spinach. Um, they have hemp, they have psyllium husk, they have a bunch of spices. So this flavor I really like, but they do have a bunch of other flavors. And if you guys are looking for a healthy, pure, like pretty natural uh, veggie burger option that you can find in the freezer, I definitely recommend that you check out Hillary's because they taste really good. All right, we're getting down to the end, but the next two things are snacks. And I'm actually going to be including these in more depth in another video that talks all about snacks that you can bring on the airplane with you. But they're also a favorite of mine, so I'm going to include them in this month's roundup. And the first one is square bars. So I am seriously in love with square bars. They are my favorite protein bar on the market, they are so good, they taste like candy. I've talked about them in my online grocery haul. I usually buy them on Amazon because you can buy a package for cheaper. My favorite flavor is this one, which is the chocolate coated coconut, but this one is also really good. It's their chocolate coated crunch, 
And then they also have a peanut butter one that's really good. They came out with a bunch of new flavors this fall, which I'm really excited to try. And what I like about the Square Bars is that they are vegan, they're gluten-free, they do have some chocolate, so they have a little bit of sugar in them, but they are high in protein. One bar has 11 grams of protein, and they taste really good. They're a great post-workout meal replacement if you don't have time to like pick up something or make something, they're a great option. So I definitely recommend you guys get them on Amazon if you can't find them locally. I'm gonna link to my favorite flavor in the description box below, so check that out if you're interested. Next is another little bar that I have been loving, and these are Health Warrior Chia Bars. What I really like about these ones is that they're teeny tiny, they're only like this big, and they're only 100 calories per bar. So the flavor that I have is chocolate peanut butter. I love anything chocolate peanut butter. I'm such a sucker for that flavor combination. But they come in a bunch of other flavors. They have a good one that is, they have a banana one that's really good. They have a coconut one that's really good. They have a coffee one that's really good. And these are awesome to just throw in your bag, have with you when you're on the go. If you, if you need something quick and easy to snack on, they're great to grab. And they're great, they have a clean ingredient list. They're, again, only 100 calories. They're primarily made of chia, which is high in omega-3 fatty acids and stuff that's really good for you and they taste awesome. So if you guys haven't tried the Health Warrior Chia Bars, I definitely recommend you check them out. So the next two things I have are perfect for this time of year because I am a huge tea drinker. I'm obsessed with tea. I actually don't drink coffee and I have two of my favorites here to share with you today. So the first is Egyptian licorice mint tea. This is hands down my favorite tea of all time. I love the flavor. Don't be afraid of the licorice sound. When I first discovered it, I was like, oh my God, no way, because I do not like licorice at all. But my friend had it and she served it to me. But ever since, I have been totally hooked. I have a cup every single night. It's great for digestion. It has a little bit of sweetness, which I love. Um, it's minty and it's really refreshing. It's calming and it's the perfect after dinner tea. And it just tastes so good. And last but not least in my October favorites, is another tea that I love, especially this time of year because it's cold and flu season. And this is Throat Coat in the Lemon Echinacea flavor. So this tea is from Traditional Medicinals and it tastes so yummy. It's perfect with like a little bit of honey mixed in or a little bit of extra lemon. Whenever you're feeling like you have a sore throat coming on or you just need something that's really calming and soothing, this tea is one of my favorites. I also just love having it like on a cold afternoon if I'm snuggled up on the couch. This is the perfect tea to kind of keep you cozy, keep you warm, and because it has some echinacea in it, it also helps boost your immune system. And of course, the throat coat aspect of it helps to calm your sore throat if you have one. So it's a great option. This is a great brand. They have amazing teas. They have tons of selections. I also really like their detox tea and they have a dandelion root tea that I really like. Um, and I highly recommend that you guys check out their entire line of teas because there is so much to choose from, but I definitely love this throat coat this time of year. And there you have it, my friends. That is my entire monthly favorites for the month of October. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Of course, as always, I have linked all of these products in the description box below, so you can check those out if you want to pick them up or just learn more about them. I hope you guys found some inspiration, and I hope that you end up trying some of these things because they're all so good, really healthy, of course, vegan, gluten-free, check in all those boxes. And if you guys have actually been loving any specific products this month, share them in the comments below, especially anything pumpkin flavored. <laughs> I'm like so in love with pumpkin right now. So if you have found some pumpkin flavored something that you're loving, let me know in the comments below. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel already, you can do so by clicking the button that I have put up in this corner. Automatically subscribes you and lets you know whenever I share a new video. And other than that, I hope you guys have a great rest of your week. Enjoy the weekend, and I will see you on Tuesday for a brand new recipe video. Bye!